Africa, comrades. Sure. Because it's been a long time coming. Sure. Many years, 30 years almost, this country went through a transformation process. We left apartheid and entered a new dispensation called the Democratic State of South Africa. And in that Democratic State of South Africa, you the masses all gathered here. You're supposed to be the beneficiaries of your wealth, your land, and your economy. Today, we are gathered here to say the ones that were given the mandate, which are the banks, to give us this economy in terms of its wealth, money, loans, finance, access to resources that we needed in order to build this in order to build this land and to build our lives, are not doing their job. These racist banks that were here in the financial district of Santin today to occupy and to demonstrate too that after we have gone past apartheid, today they are treating us worse than what apartheid did. In apartheid times, no black person's bank accounts was closed. They didn't care about you anyway. Here we are in the new democracy. Our bank accounts are closed. In apartheid days, they didn't repossess your things again. None of us were had, had properties that were repossessed again. Apartheid did not care about us. Today, our properties are repossessed. Today, our cars are repossessed. Today, our assets are repossessed. Today, the students do not have loans that they need to get an education and a qualification. And they are blacklisted as such they cannot even receive their certificates of graduation. Today, you don't have cars because banks refuse to finance black people in South Africa. Young white students while in university are driving nice cars. They have beautiful flats. They have income. They can go and eat in restaurants. But when it comes to black people, they say it's wrong. Our people do not qualify, nor do we even look as a people that is supposed to live a respectable life. We are tired. We, are, we know very well that in 1994, we negotiated a settlement, right? Today, we are no longer in 1994. That settlement that they negotiated to say that hand over power to whites in terms of the economy, give people the only power, which is to vote. We are saying, down with that power. We want the financial power. We want the economic might. We want to own our economy. We want our money, which is sitting in these banks, which has been given by our government. I'm going to teach you something today. And please remember it, my people. Manzo! Please remember this message.